A very good morning to you. If you're just joining us today, my name is Valentine or at Color Me Val, and you are watching Why in the Morning. Good morning. Welcome to the, I don't know why I'm welcoming you to the day, but it is the fifth day of June 2024, and I have been hosting with one Grace Maingi. And previously, in the Beningi, we played a game, we played riddles, and then she already gave us some sin a little bit over there we have had a feature and now we are at the tail end of the show now before we get on i'd like to tell you how you can interact with us at white 5 on facebook white 5 4 channel on x y254 underscore channel on instagram of course there is threads tiktok and them of and of importance is YouTube, just in case you miss an interview or you just want to see something again and again, you know what to do. Hashtag of the day is white in the morning or WCW. Now it's Empowerment Cafe, but now we are having a conversation with a very, very, very gorgeous panel. Yes, they look very nice. One almost do in your channel. Good morning, ladies. Good morning. <laughs> How are you? Good you look quite lovely. You look, making me look good on CV. Mm -hmm. I'll start with you. Please introduce yourself. Uh, I'm Lynette mm -hmm. Moteu. Mm -hmm. I'm a second year student mm -hmm. uh, pursuing a diploma in TV production. Mm. Hey, sorry. Uh -huh. Yes. Uh -huh. Yeah, I know, right? <laughs> <laughs> so I'm a baker. Mm -hmm. I'm also an artist. Mm -hmm. Like, artist, silly artist or Kuimba. Mm -hmm. Yeah, like artists. Uh, artists Mugani, spoken word, wakuchora, no, waku okay, dance. Uh, yeah, pia, um, dancer kidogo kidogo. Mm -hmm. Pia like I do make use of this. Is it to chupa mna tupa tupoko like? I do make something out of them. Uh -huh. Yes, go. Uh -huh. <laughs> so you know, after this conversation is actually designed for someone like you. Yes. But like, is it too powerful? Mm -hmm. The way we like, we need to recycle. No, we need to pay for it. She had me at money. Uh -huh. <laughs> yes, eh, pay for it is important. Uh -huh. So like, yeah, I'm also a baker. We need to make some money too. I'm also an upcoming actress. Mm -hmm. Yes, so. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. All right, how can we find you on social media? Uh, at I have a TikTok account and you can mainly active at mm -hmm. at Lynette mm -hmm. that is L Y N E mm -hmm. dot T E mm -hmm. zero three. Mm -hmm. Yeah. You look so focused with your life. Mm -hmm. hey, when I grow mm -hmm. up, I want to be just like you. <laughs> You're I, still growing up. But I'm me, I'm still children. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. I'm Tanil Lazmisha. And what's your lovely name? Okay, so my name is Priti Kamata. Mm -hmm. Recently graduated from KCA University. Mm -hmm. I'm an accountant by profession. Mm -hmm. I'm a podcaster, YouTuber, and I'm also a TikToker. Mm -hmm. I dance. I love dancing. Mm -hmm. uh, sometime back I did modeling, but right now mm -hmm. I don't think it's in my line of thoughts. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so that's basically me. Tell us about your podcast. What is it about? Okay, my podcast is all about being young with pretty. Mm -hmm. Like it's all about being young. Mm -hmm. What we as young people do, what we engage in, what we feel we should be doing. Yeah, it's just basically about being young mm -hmm. and just living. <laughs> okay. So being young, just give me like the, the top three topics. It's poor relationship to Najoy and Moja. Okay, we've talked about money, mm -hmm. uh, like ways on how we can invest as young people, because I think people tend to think that you should invest when you're old, mm -hmm. of which I don't think that should be the case. You should start investing when you're young. You're wise. Yes. Mm. <laughs> I'm wise, thank mm. you. So that in your, as they say, life starts at 40. For mm. me, I think at 40, you're just supposed to be relaxing and your money is working for you. Wow. Yeah. Hey, your money. All right, visionary, I see. Yeah. All right, okay, okay. How can we find you on social media? Okay, on Instagram, it's underscore. Kavata mm -hmm. on TikTok, it's at Pretty Kavata. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think Ukondo is mainly active mm -hmm. unless Munataka hey, <laughs> number. Hey, 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 ego down in the DM, ego down. All right, ladies. Now, the question, or rather, the point of discussion today is just basically we're going to talk about the uh, environment in commemoration of World Environment Day. Now, how can okay. 
this is the question, but we're going to broaden it out a little bit. So how can we be, as the youth, be champions of protecting the environment, of its con conservation? If you hear the word environmentalist, what do you think immediately? And all the time, all the time, all the time. It's not one holiday that is enough. Hmm? Is that what an environmentalist does? What do you think? Kapati? Okay, for me, I think mm. it's broad. Being everywhere, anyone can be an environmentalist mm -hmm. by just making sure that the surrounding is clean and also making sure that wherever you go, you keep clean. Because environmentalist sounds more like you have to do something like plant mm -hmm. a tree. I don't know, maybe put dust dustbin somewhere, but everybody should be an environmentalist since uh, environment is a third generation right mm -hmm. whereby it involves solidarity and collectiveness. Mm -hmm. Like you can't do it by your own because it involves everyone. Mm -hmm. So I think everybody is an environmentalist. Do you agree? Yeah, yeah I do. Because mm -hmm. in a situation whereby, like I myself, I can't be an environmentalist without the help of someone else. Mm -hmm. Assuming like I drop something here, mm -hmm. like to me it's right, I have the right to drop it there. But someone else can come and tell me, hey, you <laughs> are <laughs> 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 It is your right to drop it, okay? Yes, like I can just drop it anywhere I want. Uh -huh. Like Sibura can me maliza na na so like why should I keep it? Nani wao me buy. Nani mini me buy. Okay. <laughs> so like it's like to me, Najua, it's right to drop it. Uh -huh. But someone else will come and tell me, hey, kindly, please pick uh -huh. up. That's not the right place to, like, uh -huh. rush up. Like, there are dustbins there, you can drop it at certain points, you see. So, like, it needs what wengi. See, mimi peke yangu. Because not everyone is like, akili yako sawa. Now that you brought something up, ata kabla tuendele, let's just talk about mindset, eh? Mm -hmm. So, Kuna fa kuwa na police ya kushina wa kumbusha hatu. Excuse, 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 yo switch drop course ya mekula ufai kutupa tupa hapo. Is that not common sense? Ama common sense is not usually it's common, not common for common everyone. To all. Okay. I think it's common sense. Aha. Uh Because -huh. it's all about you as uh -huh. a person. It's like when you're in your, in your house. Do you eat, then leave the ninis to semi kama nizom for pazanyama, do you leave them on the table? After you're done, mm -hmm. si unazichukwa, then you go. Unazirusha kwa dustbin. Mm -hmm. And uh, maybe every Friday or any every other month, you have these people that come collecting. So lazmo utoe kwa nyumba, alafu utoe nje. Uh -huh. So I think the same should apply everywhere you go. Because mm -hmm. you can't tell me it's your right to drop something. Please feel free to intercede. <laughs> <laughs> you said, I'm going to be a dog. Ina like mm. kuna watu ukiangalia mse mtuko amelelele designer kuna maid amemaliza kula anacha tu plate hapo go to the room unapata kila kitu like iko tu disorganized this is a person utampata tao ametupa tu kitu anyway na kuna kitu utamwambia mm -hmm. see we have kanjo in town mm -hmm. i don't think we should be there at to check up on you sijui mbona unarusha but see tuko na hizo dust bins put everywhere the reason they are put there is because they know you will have that bottle of water. Mm -hmm. You'll finish taking that water and you'll need to throw that bottle. Mm -hmm. So that's why they've made it easier for you and put those dustbins there. Mm -hmm. If they really wanted you to just throw them carelessly, then mm -hmm. they wouldn't put those dustbins but there. But like still people throw even with those dustbins. Mtu mm utubadu -hmm. atatu patakataka. Malitua nataka maliata jiskia. So like, I think that's being Kwa match pia likile unafungua tu dirisha, shua. Ata haikuhusu, mimi haikuhusu ya tu unabonga mtu. Wei boreke tu mimefungua dirisha, umerusha. Ok. Let's come back to being young with pretty. Being <laughs> young with pretty. If this was a problem on your podcast, how would we find a solution? A solution? Eh, tunafa kuita... Ok, Lynn, alini side note, badaya kaniambia. By the way, Val, let me speak as a Gen Z. And yeah, you've looked at me and seen I'm not Gen Z. Prof, you don't go to Piganes, come on, yeah, the difference between Gen Z and me. So, what kind of forum do you want to do? Not cut when the TikTok, we have a challenge. Ya kurusha vitu kwa dustbin in the mjue. By the way, it's not right to be doing this. Because it's not the generation that pollutes that's going to suffer. It's the next two after you, eh? CCC. 
So you are comfortably littering because it's your right. <laughs> but who's going to suffer? Someone else. So how do we get your attention? Okay, I think a anything starts from you as a person. Mm. Like whatever you would want to do to yourself, make sure you do it to everyone else. Because mm -hmm. it's all fun, you throwing those things around, mm -hmm. until it's actually affecting you. Mm -hmm. That's when you'll realize, ah, kumbe, I should not be doing this. So first, I think it should start with you as a person. And again, I think people should create awareness and uh, they should learn more on how to keep the environment clean so that they can broaden their thoughts, right? Mm, mm. Yeah, so that's my thought. Clean, do you agree? Okay, like, no, I'm going to come to you. So, I'm going to say that I'm going to say that I'm going to say like, no, sir, I've been real with life. Mm -hmm. Like, yeah, it's good, like, at least people are quite educated on like on the proper disposal, how to keep the environment clean. Because CCC pekeake tuta suffer. Because like Ukiangalia, we also have our national parks. We have the wildlife. Mm -hmm. Also them, they'll be affected. Mm -hmm. Now like, you know, with animals, like, si eti atapata karatasi yapa, like, achukue, like, ende atupe, atatafuna. Because ya kwa ke, yi namkalia chakula. The animal will end up dying, what, blah, blah, blah. So like at some point, like what one of our were educated, mm -hmm. one the consequences then is in Akujana if the environment is not clean, mm -hmm. and also like the positive fact about it if the environment is kept clean. Mm -hmm. Yeah. kwa animals kakumbuka. See is a wrong guy kindly. I'm not talking about that. Kuna kuna masa ya December December where where people from Nairobi migrate to the coast. Miss Junani alewambia unezenda coast December peke yake. But it's a holiday. Bwana hizi holiday zingine amwezi enda. Mtu anatoka ushagula ende kujibamba bahari. Mna alafu mnaenda na suti kwa maji. We can see we know our people. Kuna time to learn to call that. No, 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 how tides recede. So you want to go as far as possible. Yes, uh, so, no, no, full suit, tie, nini. Sema. We only wait. 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 We make it sound like I believe he thought it was an auspicious yes. occasion. Mm -hmm. And if it's an auspicious occasion, mm -hmm. unavasu, unavasu suit, uh, but ni beach. That's not the point. <laughs> anyway, so mkisha <laughs> jaza bahari, uh, you want to take pictures, nini, beach, yani, what? You see m a sea of people kuliko the sea itself. Mm -hmm. But by the time you're leaving, like may have picnic, may have fun, may pick a picture, but you've left so much trash over there. How are you expecting to find the same beach come next December? One year near and realistic a little bit. It is. It is. Mm -hmm. And it's also giving the people who work there lots work. extra work. So how how can we be more responsible as people? I think people should engage in uh, clean up activities, mm -hmm. like as a community, like Koizo beaches, people should come up mm -hmm. uh, and uh, have groups that actually as young people go. See when you are a holiday, mm -hmm. but okay, for the ones that are coming. <laughs> Nope. I told Janifikia, but nope. Okay, for the ones that are coming for the holidays, mm -hmm. I think soon on anga kama ukingia place kuna ile like uh, it's restriction mm -hmm. or it's something that you're told. Okay, usitupe, takataka hapa, usifanyevo. I think uh, doing something like that, telling them if you have something to throw, there's somewhere we've set aside for you guys to. It's like when you want to go to the toilet. Mbona always the end of toilet anywhere, mm -hmm. lazima after the actual toilet where it is, mm -hmm. do not have direction your toilets when you go. The same way, like they should have put a direction to somewhere, ndo kila mtu asirushe takataka everywhere. Mm -hmm. Show them that that's where we, we are supposed to throw them to avoid littering the, the compound. But for the people who are around, I think they should engage also in cleanup activities. Mm -hmm.
to also ensure that our oh, watu wakikuja they find the place clean. Mm -hmm. Yeah. We should live somewhere better than we found yeah. it. Found it. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. Yeah, we found it. Talk to me. I can see who shines up for Saudi. Talk to me. Okay, like regarding what she was saying of like, is it possible? We see two petta kata kapa. Like as you had said earlier, common sense is not common to all. Mm -hmm. Una mtu atakuja tu na endazi. Ano na tu vizuri posti me andi kosi tu petta kata kapa. Kwanza apo ndo na tupa. Apo kwanza apo juu na taka mtadu. Ni metupa mtafanya. Ni kujieni. Ni kuj ni kujieni. So like with me, like unona ukienda at some places, like iso restrictions ana sema kuna mibi le kwenye wata restrict people from carrying vitu za plastic. Wengine they'll be like come with those the disposable whatever the cups the plates in such a way that ukimaliza na na it will be easy for you to dispose. So like with me. Uh, I'll, I'll say, I'll think of maybe like Ikue, um, like at some certain points, like you see, like I'm seated here, this, that uh, disposable, the beans, then a few meters away from me, there's also a disposable bin. And you make sure like when you're seated there, out of field, uvivuya, ukuja maliniko disposable. Because mm -hmm. you are seated there, disposable being CG, then the person will be like, I can't walk until there. Mm -hmm. It's too far. Mm -hmm. So like, acha ni tupe hapa. Si wanalipwa. Watakuja kuwa kota. Kwa zataka yu kazi si yangu. Yu kwa adieta si yangu. Mbona niende ni jisumbwe. Kwa ni wanalipwa nini? Ana nigawe mshara. <laughs> si mjui. Mm -hmm. Let them do. Na ache, atacha tu vitu hapa comfortable ya ende. Mm -hmm. So like with me, I'll think of like at every few meters, mm -hmm. like kwa kunizo the disposable being sent, the likes, mm -hmm. to make it easier. Mm -hmm. Yeah. That's euphoria. It's like the perfect world, eh? Mm -hmm. But nisawa. Nisawa <laughs> is fine. It's fine. There are these places that are very strict with how you just even enter. Yeah. We've talked yeah. about our parks, Niniwapi. Kuna time to menda aboreta, we went for a picnic with a group of people. Attack a blowing gear, you're mm -hmm. inspected. You can't go in with plastic. You, uh, mm -hmm. you cannot, like everything you have yeah. must be reusable. You cannot play loud, extra loud music. Because, okay, guys, there's different types of pollution. Likwani wambi, old noise, pollution, water, pollution, air pollution, and all that. But there's specific rules set up because they know why that wezi kuna wezi kuna games flani wezi cheza hapo ndani simply because nyasi ni kama inaona haita grow venye na eh kukanyaga kanyaga eh labda kucheza cheza venye mnataka kucheza so the, the when i went for the first time a while back i was not very comfortable with those rules nilikasitika ju first of all si kwa najua na tukwa tumeenda na paper cups na street ni nini i was very upset they even made us buy other things like reusable things not wing yet imagine. Eh. So do you think we'll be compliant if the rules just become a bit more strict? Like Kwambia, okay, two papo, fine. Fifty thousand. Yes, hey, that's why we misuse the most. Eh, Nas Jasema ni wanome. But eh si jasema, Miss Jasema. But do you think if the rules were a bit more strict, kama tunandika uskojo ya pala futuwe kezi si TV? I don't think so. You don't think so? Why? Si si TV tena. Si tunakuona. So like amuna kazi ingini ya kufanya lezima mshinde kwa si si TV? Sasa si tumesema uskojo ya pala na we unatoka kukojo ya pala. Eh. Tafute ni kazi. Wow. Wow. Okay. What would you do? What would you suggest? Okay, now, like, kumbuke kuna kwanga na budget ya county. Like with me, I just I go with the rules. Because mm -hmm. unona saa kayo yenyo, nye mlenda na plastic cups. Na tunge zitupa hapo, imagine. We are, we are good people. Mm, tunajua aje. We are, we are good people, buwana. Tungejua aje. It is not How are they supposed to know? You, you will Nige, not know it. Nafakuwa na tatuma. Na tatu, <laughs> Ikienda sana maybe Kenya za tupa ni mindizi Ako kanini Ako kapili Because it's It's biodegradable So hapo hata na jimbia I've done your favor Mbolea Bana Yeah but this is ingine I would have not We would have not done as a group We are Watu usao Maybe mgeziacha Watu usao 
because I also remember I've been to Ololua Karen mm -hmm. for a trail and they also don't allow that. To look at the paper soda, a lot of snacks to leave the water your gate. Oh, yeah, because yeah, they didn't allow us to get in. We, they didn't trust us that Atunge uh, We tried to plead with them, but they were like, no. But Leave how them. many times have people pleaded now I can end up kufanya the, that exact same thing they said they won't do? Na uh, utajua aje ni mimi? Eh, so <laughs> the, the weird thing is, uta, ju, I, was, I was surprised. Sisi tuliacha vitu kwa gate, but tuku ndani watu wako na vitu zao. And I was like, ay, pesi tunge beba. Na watu walirusha tu uko. Ah. Eh. Yeah. So, sometimes people just break rules. So, the more tight you make them, mm -hmm. the, the harder you make it for yourselves and the people. Mm -hmm. So, I feel like just, uh, just being like softly displaying the rules makes mm -hmm. it easier. So, you've also seen people love breaking rules, mm -hmm. right? Well, mm, it, it breaking feels, rules it, is fun. I don't know why it feels good uh -huh. <laughs> breaking the rules, uh -huh. but it feels good. Mm -hmm. mm. Apo sa, you want sa to tell you, I kuwa ni pite, but like sasa jume ni ambia, nisipite, acha ni pite. Yeah, Africans. the curiosity, because mm -hmm. mbona ukinyimua kitu is when you want to know kwa nini ni menyimua. Mm -hmm. What can actually happen Uta if I do it? Unataki yoko explore hey. mwenyewe, mbona wana niambia hivi. But surely guys, this is the only, as we, as far as we know, in the year 2024, unless it kuna kitu happen na ime ni pita. This is the only inhabitable planet we have. Ah, habitable planet we have. Mm -hmm. Why are we destroying it? I think currently people are just careless with everything. Mm -hmm. it's, it's like they're not looking in the in the future. Ata sidani wanafikiria where they are. Wako too, they're just existing. Mm -hmm. They really don't care what happens, especially the Gen Z. I'm a Gen Z, but... Mono <laughs> meji <laughs> Why especially Gen Z? No, Gen Z is... Wako too. Mm-hmm. Ni kama says the Gen Z akienda interview you seen the way they are doing their interviews how are they oh, you guys work under pressure no me i can't wow like <laughs> uh -huh. mm -hmm. yes yeah so like Gen Z work or too so i feel like if we look more into the future then we will take care of what is to be taken care of at the moment to uh -huh. save the future you see uh -huh. yeah okay this is uh, i will call it a rumor because it's i've not seen it in statistics and <coughs> I can basically say it's hearsay, so to say it to But the information that I gathered, now please do, don't come for me. If I'm wrong, <laughs> I've already said I'm sorry. Eh? But it sounds like Gen Z is a generation that is not very keen on procreating. So is it possible that you, first of all, is it true? And then second, is that the reason that based on what you have said, hakuna mm. haja kubwa ya kukonserve environment. I mean, si tutayacha tu hapa. Mm -hmm. Like, si, yeah. like, si, si tutakuja tuende. Mm -hmm. So, like, we are living for now. We are not living for, like, Yo lo. Okay, what about your kids? Uh -huh. Si, oh, kikuja watajipanga. Hey. So, what if your mom also said that? Kikuja uh -huh. watajipanga, what uh -huh. would happen Say, to you? Say, you ni kitambo, it's not now. That's kitambo, not now. Uh -huh. Well... You at least like you tell me already she appeared as we are as. Uh huh. I just say to Jipanga is easy. Uh huh. When you are talking, you are talking about Uh huh. Yes. Well, I'm trying to imagine. Uh -huh. You see the schools that to Uh huh. If they were not taken care of. Uh huh. Because I believe, see, when I was 19, 19, 19, then what was 2000, if people didn't take care of that, where mm -hmm. would we be? If people did not take care of the forests, where would we be going? Mm -hmm. If people did not take care of your beach, your Mombasa, would we be going there for our vacation? Mm -hmm. Of course not. If people did not take care of the game parks, mm -hmm. of the animals that are there, Will we be going to the game parks? Mm -hmm. Of course, no. Mm -hmm. So I feel like we should also be responsible enough to act. Nobody can be like perfect 100%, but we should, to mm -hmm. a certain point, at least take care of what is around us. Mm -hmm. Because it affects the environment is a complexity of the biological, the chemical, and the physical surround mm -hmm. surroundings. And they all affect the living things in it. So if mm -hmm. we do not take care of it, and you are well, one of the living things yeah, in it. Yeah, we mm -hmm. might be affected. There might be an adverse effect. So, 
to a certain degree to go to koshas story ni za jaba na ngoka shamba they're not thinking of kids as you said uh -huh. so they're just like living in the moment is that true mama sasa tutaki put please tutete eh so it's tricky mhm mm mhm mm cuz now like they should said it the when you come same with the agencies kids mm -hmm. okay like say you tapata most agencies wako na watoto but single mothers mm -hmm. but as for me wa cha kwanza nitafute pesa tukifika huko tutafikiria okay my last question and and bo i want you to really think about it and give me an honest answer mm -hmm. do you believe that the actions of the generation that came before us our generation and the generation to come who only up kwa environment and climate change nashkana do you imagine and this is a very hypothetical question do you imagine there would have been floods the way kuma flood sijui el nino for absolute no reason dubai watu wana swim na kuna faa kuwa na joto oh um canada has wildfires do you imagine if maybe we try and do better if maybe we made a mistake before and right now what if we just started doing better do you think climate change would start reversing itself the, the earth would start healing itself ozone land everything okay okay like on my perspective mm -hmm. like una cheki kitambo kwa ni zo vitu like the it's happening now siji mara floods mara siji wapi kumeporomoka nini mm -hmm. it's because say si wenye ndo tumearibu environment so mm -hmm. like if say tunaweza we can come together we like to make sure we take care of the environment mm -hmm. to pande miti like mm -hmm. to avoid yo kutupata katako vyo vyo mm -hmm. the earth will become a better place mm -hmm. not only for us but for also the wildlife mm -hmm. and also like the the fish the nyezinishi kwa maji mm -hmm. yeah so like we can still make it if we are mm -hmm. to come together as one Although it's a very gradual process, eh? very yeah, very gradual. Yes. I don't know why it's the slowest thing. Kete, maybe we're planting today. We will may not see. Maybe our children's yeah, yeah, children. Yeah. Children's yeah. Yeah. So maybe answer on the same. Do you think I that think if I we start now? I think I will just support what she said, mm -hmm. but I think it will really take a long time. And you know, kitu inafanya na watu wengi, it really goes slowly. Ama mimi ndo nanga hivyo. Because you know, if it was for you as a person, maybe you would move a bit faster. Mm -hmm. But since it involves everyone. Kuna mwenye hata taka hata kupanda hizo miti, ataenda mm -hmm. alale. Mm -hmm. Like people are just the way they are mm -hmm. for their own reasons. Mm -hmm. So I feel like if we started doing of course small steps will lead to success. So mm -hmm. if we really start planting now in the future we will reap what we sow. Okay. Yeah. Oh, wisdom, wisdom. <laughs> All right, I see you guys. I feel you are Ah ah ah. ah, ah. <laughs> Right, uh, now we have to come to a close. Unfortunately, our time is up. But in conclusion, once more, how can we find you on social media, Lynn? Uh, at my TikTok handle. Mm -hmm. Like, up on your Nico, most active. Nyota ndo. Up on your Nyota Iko. All right. Iyo na yo account ikibanua Nyota inapote. Woo! Yes. So, at my TikTok handle is okay. Lynette. That is L-Y-N-E mm -hmm. dot T-E zero three. Mm -hmm. yeah. And you? Kavata, well, pretty Kavata. Uh -huh. <laughs> well, you can find me on Instagram at underscore Kavata and on TikTok at pretty Kavata. I'm a makeup artist. In case you need makeup for any any occasion, mm -hmm. I love it. You being an accountant and you being a content creator are just amazing. How do <laughs> do they complement each other? Well, I think they do. Growing uh -huh. up, I wanted to be on TV. Boom! <laughs> Boom! And this okay, is just the beginning. Accountant. <laughs> yeah, I wanted to do journalism and uh, newscasting. Uh -huh. But you know, after you uh, keep it up 10, you know, I, of course, you find your medicine, find mm -hmm. it. So I was told to go do accounts. Mm -hmm. And then maybe later on in life, if that's really my journey, 
I will hope on to it. Ah, Mbea Wazazi, you found it. <laughs> you found it, you found it. Thank you so much, uh, Lynn and Pretty Kavata. And uh, my dear viewers, thank you so very much for allowing us into your personal space. Wherever you are, we appreciate you for tuning in. My name is Valentine. I have been with Grace Maingi. And it is World Environment Day 2024. It happens every 5th of June. And today it just happens to fall on a Wednesday. Yeah. So thank you once again. Have yourself a wonderful day. I'll see you when I see you. But I do encourage you to stay channel Y254 because we still have so much more to offer.